So, did you figure out what you're taking to show and tell? Uh, not yet, but I'm working on it. Okay, well, let me know if you need some help. I mean, I would have really liked to take a puppy, but I don't have one. And don't, and won't. <laughs> exactly. Well, put on your thinking cap and get creative. Will do, but you know, there isn't really anything cool around here like a roof roof or a Woo! Uh, meow! But, you know, I'm sure I'll find something. Oink, oink. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Find something, then get in bed and get some rest. I'll see you in the morning. Night, Mama. Morning, sunshine. Oh, you're up already. Did you find something for show and tell? I did. Uh, Mama, are you gonna stay when I present? Yes, ma'am. I'll be there. What did you find? It's a surprise. Should I be concerned? <laughs> no, I think you'll really like it. I got really creative. Oh, all right. I can't wait to see. Come on, let's go. Hello, class. It's going to be a great day. It's show and tell day for four people. And I see that one of you all bought a special guest. <laughs> well, that's exciting. Okay, let's start with Tasha. Um, hi, everybody. My name's Tasha. And this is my bear, Blinko, and I really, really like him because he's small and cute. So I decided to bring him today for show and tell. <laughs> Hello, uh, I'm Victoria, and I decided to bring lotion today um, because this is my show and tell. Um, I really like it because it keeps me from getting ashy. Um, and if I don't use it, then I just like kind of turn like a chalkboard and I can write my name on my arm. So yeah, this is my lotion. <laughs> Hello, my name's Charlie and I brought in my plant. I grew it myself and it's my favorite because I don't even have to water it um, because it's fake. Yay, Charlie! <laughs> okay, great job so far. Hey, Coco, you're last, but definitely not least. Come on up. Hi, everyone. Today is really special because I want to make my mama a part of my presentation. Oh, Coco, really? Yep. Come on up, mama. Well, I wanted to bring something really creative and cool, so I spent a lot of time trying to get the perfect item since I don't have a pup. And don't. I know, I know, mama, but... Time. 
Well, he was, but that doesn't mean people need to be up as soon as he left, ma'am. You do know the normal time people get up on holidays is like 8 or 9 a.m. Oh, well, it feels like 9 a.m. to me. Mom, can we just start opening gifts, please? No, ma'am, that would be unfair to them, so let's just wait it out patiently. Um, you know, waiting until 9 a.m. on Christmas is a little insane, but if you like it, I guess we'd love it. So, when you say wait, are we waiting until they wake up, or do you plan on waking them up? Uh, I hope the second option, because the way Daddy's snoring upstairs, we're going to be waiting until tomorrow. <laughs> Chill out, it is not gonna take that long. Just sit back and relax. You know what, let's go around and say what we're thankful for. I'll go first. I'm thankful for you both, your dad and Ari. Family is so important to me and I'm looking forward to a good year and I'm thankful for all of our health. Oh, that's so sweet, mama. And as we all know, your youngest child was your main blessing. Coco, stop, you all were a blessing. Why, why, why? Okay, okay, me next. So this year, I'm very thankful for getting into high school. I'm halfway through the freshman year, and it's been amazing. Oh, I'm sure, and I really have noticed, Rita, really, that your head continues to grow, but I'm sure that's from all the knowledge that you've been retaining. Be quiet. Anyways, I'm also very thankful for my family and friends. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Oh, Rhea, that's so sweet. Thanks. Very sweet, Rhea. Okay, 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 smart one. I'm really happy and thankful that Santa came early this year because last year it seemed like he was having some issues because you and Daddy kept telling us to stay upstairs because he forgot to wrap our gifts. So I'm really happy that he got some extra elves to help out this year. Yeah, me too. Those little guys really come through when you need them. <laughs> let's, let's just focus on today, though. Yeah, well... I'm just so thankful for you, Mama and Daddy. You guys sacrificed so much for us, especially this year since I forgot to leave my list out for Santa, and you took it all the way to the North Pole. I'm so thankful for that. Uh, I hope you were able to stay warm when you went, though. <laughs> yeah, it, it was tough, but we made it, and Santa clearly made it, too. Yeah, well, we're done with that now. Any chance they're waking up yet? Let's wait it out a little longer. Fine. How about this? We each open one gift. Yay, finally! Okay, um, I want to open this one first. No, wait, wait, Mama. I want you to open the gift first because you deserve it. Oh, thank you, Coco. Let's see what it is. So thin. A lottery ticket. Thank you, Coco. I might just get lucky today. Pass me a coin. Here you go, Mom. Now remember, if you win, I'm your oldest daughter and all I need is a car soon. Okay, ma'am. If I win, I'll make sure you all get something nice. Let's see. Don't scratch it up, Mama. <laughs> My car. Uh, any luck yet, Mama? <laughs> that's, that's the winning ticket. Mama, Mama. Coco, that's the winning ticket. <laughs> Yes, you are getting that car. And Coco, what do you want, baby? Uh, let's see. Uh, a dinosaur? You know what? You got it. It's yours. Yay! But we also have to be responsible and save. I need to invest for retirement. Oh my goodness, this is the best Christmas ever! Well, can I get a little bit like 30% since I bought it? Well, don't forget about me. I was here for moral support. Of course. Well, not 30%, but I'll put $100 in your piggy bank. And Rhea, we'll figure out something for you. Well, wow. I guess only one of us is going to have enough for retirement. Let me go wake up your dad. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Oh, I cannot believe you're millionaires. Me either. I'm going to ask mom to build me a house in the backyard so I can get away from YouTube rats and... Oh my gosh, the beaches. The beaches sound so nice. What do you think about the beaches, Coco? Mm -hmm. Sounds great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Why does this say this product is not a real lottery ticket and any attempt to cash it holds a minimum jail sentencing of five years? Coco! Uh -huh. Where did you get this? Amazon. Why? Are you serious? So we're not rich? Uh, I wanted to see you happy. 
Well, now you're about to see me mad. It was just a little joke. A joke that was going to put me in jail. I wasn't going to let it go that far. Well, you let it go far enough to raise my blood pressure. Oh, well, maybe we should open up the other gifts so that it can go back down. They aren't as exciting. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say now?